Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on the 9 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow futures are up 190. I guess there's some news about uh, some uh, possibly, I, th I think it's the Iranian uh, deal where uh, some oil comes onto the market. That's a big relief. So now Dow's up 210 is a big move because I was talking about in my show that I did early uh, at 8 o'clock to 9 Eastern time, just finished, it'll be replayed at 10. I was talking about this cluster pattern in the Dow where the fourth, the, the fifth candle after the 24th of January, that candle was strong to the upside after the cluster formation consolidation. We've just had a cluster formation. This is the fifth day after that 24th of February low. And now we're going to see if there's another big candle to the upside. That's going to be really important. We're looking at the S&P. Let's go to the futures. The S&P futures are up. As I said, they're up also sharply. They're up 34 at 4,416. That's the same pattern right here. Cluster formation, breakout. We're looking at the Q. Can these hold? I don't see any reason at this particular point why they shouldn't hold. Uh, but the QQQs, they were lagging yesterday. Now they're up uh, 2.91, up three, at, at 350.12. I'm just trying to check the, uh, so now, uh, yeah, so that's a 0.84%. That's going to be good, but they really need to get to the 352 level, and that'll say, ah, now we've got something. We're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, which actually held a little bit better than the others yesterday. It's up $1.57 at 205.78. This is as good as making the arch pattern that goes from the first arch to the second arch. That's good. Looking at gold, did gold pull back? Uh, we'll see. Gold is up six. It was up a lot more before, but it's still holding that upper range. And that is a, a, a it's in the upper range. Looking at crude oil, what is happening there? Let's see if crude oil finally, you got a red candle. Oh, red candle. A red candle where it's down two and a half at 108.37. Uh, made an all time, well, not an all time, but a recent recovery high of 116.57. This is going to be a big deal. This is really going to help the markets. And we're looking at, I uh, wanted to do the TLT. The TLT, that's bonds, uh, is up a dollar at 137.56, still at the lower part of the range. And that's just telling us that uh, yields remain in the higher level. How do they come down? We'll have to see if they do come down. So with that said, the VIX index is now down a little more than it was earlier when I was on. It's down 1.22, uh, uh, down 4% at 29.52. If this holds through the day, this could be a really nice recovery rally. Let's see what happens. Thank you for coming.